A viral video showed a California sheriff's deputy running away from an enraged suspect after the deputy's stun gun shot failed to subdue him. What really happened? A driver was blocking the loading area outside the Costco distribution center in Mountain House, which is about an hour east of San Francisco, around 7 p.m. on Wednesday on local time. Jewel Armstrong, who was working security at the faculty, called the San Joaquin County Sheriff's Office for help. Armstrong told the KCRA TV that when the deputy arrived, the man became more combative, that she began recording a video of the confrontation. The clip shows the deputy repeatedly ordering the man to get on the ground. At one point, the man does, does so. But then he hops back up, walks toward what's presumably his car, opens the driver's side door. The man pushes the approaching deputy with his left hand and the driver's side door with his right hand and the deputy stumbles backward. But as the deputy falls to the ground, he fires his stun gun at the man. The man pulls the props out and then screams and charges to the deputy. The deputy drops the stun gun and runs away from the man. The suspect also hits the retarding deputy the station set. The clip then shows the suspect entering the deputy's patrol vehicle through the side door. The deputy opens the door, orders the man and then the video fades to another shot showing that the man re entry was presumably in his own car. The deputy orders the man to exit, but the suspect is set pills in reverse. The suspect then rams in, in the deputy's patrol car, exits the vehicle and begins running off. For more, search for the clip. It's going viral on internet and it's pretty interesting.